So hi dear Pisces, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a journal of reading for all the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you in the first place. The second thing, this is a reading from today till the end of March and I ate all of my, uh, uh, what we call it, lip balm. And I am feeling like uh, stretchy lips. Anyway, okay, chat. So let's see, in the recent past, what was happening with my dear Pisces? We had, I like you, someone likes you, romance is blooming, fun, flirting, want to date. Somebody was in this energy of liking you a lot, okay, asking you on a date. Even if they were not asking for a date, uh, date thing, you knew that somebody in your energy, somebody around you were liking you, uh, was liking you and they wanted some fun, flirting and they wanted to date you, right? In the recent past it was happening. It could be you liking somebody and wanted to date. It is a new person and new kind of energy, newish kind of energy that I feel for you. Uh, you f you both felt uh, the romance is blooming, the attraction is happening. You go you both were feeling each other's energies and uh, like uh, like feeling good about it. Like I am feeling good about it right now. You, I like that kind of energies. Yep. But beyond that, when the like real relationship starts, my God, kill me. Okay, let's see the current energies for you, Pisces. We have the sunglasses, watching, looking, stalking, perception, focusing out. Somebody currently, either you are stalking somebody online or somebody is stalking you online. Like you are keeping some kind of uh, uh, tabs on someone here or somebody is keeping tabs on you. This is someone who is like uh, looking at your pictures. They are showing you like they don't uh, have any kind of interest in you, but they are keeping tabs on you. This is somebody is definitely showing you that they are not at all interested in you, but trust me, they are more than interested or at least they are interested in knowing what you are up to and where you are or these days and whom you are dating and whom you are connecting and all this shit. So right now these energies are of stalking, gaslighting. It could be like uh, on and off energy, somebody is talking to you someday and uh, the next day they are like gone and then they are talking, then they are gone. You, oops, oopsie. Or you might be doing this with someone because you are not sure what you're feeling for them or what you have to do with them. <laughs> you're just doing it. Okay, anyway. So what are your energies for a new person or new connection, Pisces? Mama, I'm in love with the criminal. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Listen to this song. I think you are going to get some kind of message out of that. I don't know why I t said it. I just said it. Yeah, I'm crazy. Yeah, anyway, sweetheart, so right now your, uh, uh, your energy for a past person or sorry, uh, your energy for a new person or new, uh, new connection is that you are still learning from the past. You are still having lots of memories from the past person or past situation. I do see you connected to a new person or soon you are going to connect to a new person or new energy. But there will be a lot of things from the past that will keep coming back in your memories, keep coming back in your dreams or keep coming back like a... Uh, uh, you are going to see your partner's, you, the, the past person's name or past person. You are going to feel their energy a lot of the times. So I don't think you will be in this energy of for making connection or situation or relationship with somebody new. Although you will try, but I don't think that is going to happen. Because you have still a lot of less lessons that you still need to learn from the past. I think in some cases you are trying to rush into a new connection or new situation because you want to uh, get out of the past pain and hurt and all this. Don't do that. And that is going to affect your future relationship also, current relationship also. Please don't do that. And if you are single from a very long time, you are still in this energy of not being able to connect with the, somebody on that level that you want to be. Right? Hmm. Let's see what are your energies for a past person or past connection. We have the healing heart. Yeah, you are healing from a heartbreak, freedom from a toxic relationship or addiction. You are still in the healing process, Pisces. You are still not completely healed. You are still like trying to uh, like uh, fix your pieces, fix, uh, fix your broken heart and move ahead and keep going. But it's, it's, it's painful, but you are still on the process of healing. See, you, you got the freedom from a toxic relationship or a toxic situation or you guys were addicted to each other like physically only. There was no love or something like that. Okay, so you are just healing from that kind of energy. And uh, might be it's painful for you and you're taking it, as a, uh, taking it in a very, very negative way, Pisces. But trust me, healing is painful. 
but the end result is very good so keep healing keep moving and if you got freedom from a toxic connection or situation take it as a blessing i know how it feels i was in a connection with somebody like it was a very toxic relationship and it was like it sucked the blood out of me for 3 to 4 years when i came out of it i cried like crazy for like 4 5 6 months and i was like oh my god why it happened with me i i loved that man so much i wanted that man so much i want to be with them blah 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 but after 5 6 months i realized that that was a blessing in disguise for me i'm not the same person as i used to be and i will never be because now i understand uh, like god helped me in that case so take it as a blessing sweetheart okay let's see what is the guidance for you Cupid's arrow have faith love is coming surprise invitation or meeting or hesitation so don't hesitate to go in meetings or invitations or parties if you get some kind of surprise invitation or meeting offer or get together offer or like mutual friends meeting whatever it is just go there your love might be waiting <laughs> uh for you in that uh, like area but anyway this is just a direct message to those people who are completely single who are looking for new love and who are having no faith in love and who are healing i think you should you should just start meeting new people and if you are getting meet like uh, invitations or something like this don't hesitate to go out of your comfort zone okay sweetheart thank you so much pisces i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste